Okay, here's here's a little update on this robot. I upgraded the radio to the, the Spectrum DX6i. This radio works really nicely with the Sabertooth 2x25. Some guys have asked me what is the track length. The track length is four and a half feet. Um, the track length is a little bit longer than most of these rubber tracks which come in right around four feet. So this particular track drive brand, if you can find that on snow blowers, has a longer base front to back. This is this is the robot's two two feet wide and it's um this wheelbase is about two feet, so I made it, I just basically made it a square, and then it sticks out a little bit back and a little bit in front. When you're looking around for these track units on snow blowers and such, you have to be careful the smooth idler wheel would build up snow between the track and the wheel, you know, snowball effect, making it increase and increase and increase in diameter and then crack the track. Actually, one of these tracks is actually slightly longer than the other because there's a crack in it. I've got a metal brace right here that almost touches the wheels, that keeps them clean. People have asked me, how much does this weigh? Right now, with this configuration, it weighs 160 pounds. The blade is, is run by an Arduino, and then uh, I've got some software on the Arduino, and that's all on my YouTube channel. So that linear actuator is actually working as a digital proportional servo. If I move the stick here, it finds that position and it stays there. But the other nice thing about this configuration is, is that it's so quiet. So that's it. That's where it is as of uh, December 18th, 2011. Um, which also happens to be an unbelievably warm day in Minnesota.